All right, so in this short video, uh, we're going to be highlighting the Maillard uh, reaction that's referenced in the reading uh, that you have. So one of the best examples to use to explain the Maillard reaction uh, is cooked onions, or in this case right now, raw onion. An onion at uh, normal room temperature is made up of water, sugars, and amino acids. Okay, I don't know if you heard that was the bell. Well, in any case, so now you know that I'm making this recording at school. So an onion is made out of water, sugars, and amino acids. So when you take the onion and you put it in a saucepan and you add a little bit of energy, as we've been discussing in class, when you add energy to, to molecules, to, re, um, to bonds, you can break those bonds and potentially rearrange atoms. So the same same with this particular reaction with onions. So we add heat to the onion and the reshuffling of atoms occurs. Okay, But this is the really cool thing about this particular reaction is that they don't just randomly reshuffle and attach uh, to another atom, but they actually make very specific flavor profiles. So an onion and its raw state or even just steamed, we add just a little bit of heat up, you know, boiling water, uh, you don't end up with a lot of flavor, but when you add a little bit of heat, they will actually rearrange and create different flavors. Okay, so here you have an image of an onion that's been slightly cooked over the saucepan, but you cook it for just a little bit longer and you add a little bit more heat at about 300 degrees Fahrenheit, 300, 330 degrees, you actually have the onion caramelized and it becomes a very sweet flavor and actually you can have your kitchen smell very sweet as well as those sugar molecules will um, will basically um, aerate your your kitchen and your house now if you add too much heat at about 400 degrees Fahrenheit or 204 Celsius you end up breaking way too many bonds and the oxygen and the hydrogen will essentially turn into a gas and in a go off into the air and you're left with the carbon okay so you end up with a charred onion okay so again in in review uh, the Maillard reaction is is a um, an interesting interesting phenomena that occurs when you add heat to to a to a special blend of water sugars and amino acids and you come out with a various uh, blend of different flavors hope you enjoy the rest of your reading